beginning, there was only ocean. Until the mother island emerged. Some began to seek Te Fiti's heart. They believed if they could possess it, the great power of creation would be theirs. And one day, darkness that will continue to spread, chasing away our fish, draining the life from island after island until every one of us is devoured by the bloodthirsty jaws of inescapable death. Take video of Mia. Mia! You look so cute. Okay. Alright, we just did our first trip with Mia to Home Depot and grocery shopping. And she we're just filmed everywhere. Yeah, and then actually didn't film that much, but we also got her some shoes at Carter's. So we went to three places and she did good. She did good with all of them. You're putting your fingers. We went to three places. <laughs> but she did so good. Oh, I need to put my <laughs> seat belt. My please. seat belt. She did good until we got pulled over. Oh no, we're not gonna get pulled over. We just gave her some crackers whenever she got fussy, but she's been up for like two hours now. That was the hotel I used to work at, by the way. Me and Taba used to work there. Aww. That's where our love started. Where our love began. Started at the convention. Well, yeah. And then he got a job. Amelia, there. we're telling a story. We're telling. Uh huh. What else, Mia? Wow, wow, wow. So we just got home and it's a mess, and we have to clean this up because our friend is coming over today. But let me quickly show you what we got. We got her stuff from Kroger. Oh, um, that's my husband's snack. But this one is her favorite toy, but this one got lost, so we had to rebuy it. It's just this little frog that makes a noise. I believe this one is like $3 or $4. Less than $5. And then we bought her these teethers because she's been loving teethers lately. Like, these has been her favorite, like the Gerber one as well. But I'm trying to stray away from Gerber because somebody told me that they have metal in them and I actually looked it up and it's actually a problem so I'm not sure which one has metal so we have a lot of Gerber baby food I'm trying to stay away but I got that flavor which is pumpkin I think yeah, this is the brand happy baby and then I got an apple or strawberry one no nope, this is strawberry carrot rice bricks carrot and strawberry baby teething and then I also got her this one, Teether Crackers. These are strawberry. Yeah, strawberry. So there's a lot of strawberry. I thought the other one was an apple. So we got her those at Kroger and other necessities we needed for the week. We just did our small grocery. Like my husband bought me a whole bunch of coffee. Like this is usually not the size that I get. I get a smaller size. And then we got a mirror for the bathroom. And we also got a towel hanger for the bathroom Home Depot. We also went to Carter's with Mia and we tried on a couple of shoes for her. And also we got a 12 month sleeper because they don't sell them in packs anymore. So we just got her this little B1. It seems so long, but we wanted to try out the 12 months for her or maybe we should do the nine months. And we also got her shoes. So these were buy one, get one free. But I think they're still overpriced for shoes. They're like $40, which is the price for a regular shoe. But I guess it's like $20 a piece. But we got this glitter butterfly one. And we just got it in a size 5 because size 4 was perfect on her. But I really wanted it to kind of 
stay with her for a little bit so she has these shoes it's glittery sportsy and they're also you can remove this and also got her just a plain white one with glitters so I really want to train her heel to kind of be flat because she's always on her toes when she's on her jumper but I know you have to train their toes or their ankle to kind of flatten so that's why I bought these harder ones and they just have hollow on them so this like drained out my allowance for us but that's okay that's what it's there for and these are just cute ones and that's all that we got for today look at them little toesies 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 Go ahead. She's watching her show on the TV. Sure, like, get in the way. Yep. <laughs> 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 You're gonna crawl just to see. <laughs> <laughs> She's maneuvering around you. <laughs> Go that way. <laughs> you want some more? <laughs> the way more. What? I'm tired. Okay, fine. Of course she's on that. I know. You only slept for 55 minutes, baby. Oh, boink. I caught her earlier. She almost fell. Like, put her head over here. She's cute. Good job. That was good. Daddy, we need changing. Please. You should take a nap today. Go take a nap. Wait over there. Good morning, guys. So this is what I'm looking this monday morning it is march 8th but i still have my sleeping mask on is that what it's called sleep mask or eye mask i don't know but i can't sleep without these and my i think either my sister or my husband bought me these they're cute but i'm making my coffee right there just my morning and i sound tired but this morning i went ahead and dove right in what I need to do today. I still haven't planned on my planner, but I've been cutting my trackers with my little cutter right there. I made all the colors for the trackers just to have a backup, and I received a couple of orders, guys. I already had a couple of orders that were sent out yesterday, and I'll be honest, I honestly haven't. I've had more orders these past two days than I had for the month, or actually the year since January like my shop has slowed down a lot just because I didn't really make a lot of effort honestly but now that I am like I've been honestly kind of thinking about my decisions lately like am I neglecting my baby by doing more of the shop stuff my husband we were talking about it a lot and he said like I need to do what makes me happy and like don't feel like I neglect Mia because I I'm a great mom and he says it a lot and I really appreciate it for that because sometimes you just need that confirmation that you're doing you're doing something okay for your family like you know I didn't I didn't grow up with the best environment when it comes to my family I mean I could talk more about that but it really wasn't the best my parents tried their best they were young they were teen parents and they did not just make the best decisions when it comes to us and I just don't want to do the same thing that's why I was always so scared of having kids that's why I'm like 28 and just having my first baby it's kind of paying off I'm actually growing I'm like kind of close to 5k on my subscribers like that just kind of I don't know I know you're, you're not supposed to focus on numbers but just this many people will watch this my 
my videos just makes me feel so happy even though not all of you guys watches my vlogs the sum of you that watches them like knows and wants to know everything i have to offer basically but i have this acrylic little board and i just keep in track of my orders when it comes to these i try to cover the name just in case i vlog it these are labels so i'm gonna write down what color they are on certain things so i won't get confused but that's what i'm gonna work on today i'm also gonna work on our debt numbers because i know everything's updated usually my Candon's card updates on the 6th or the 7th but it updated on the 7th so I'm gonna make that video today hopefully and have that ready for you guys in a couple of days because I'm excited since we paid off my ring this um, this time around so that won't be there anymore and we're just gonna see how our debt numbers are for the beginning of March I'm kind of late but I can't do anything about my Candon's card not updating right away so We'll just deal with it i think my coffee's done i'll update you guys some more later let me show you my schedule actually for the week so this is my schedule i work 5 to 10 today i'm off tomorrow and then i have 3 to 10 5 to 10 5 to 10 and i'm off and i was off yesterday so like i was saying our our schedule is from sunday to sunday and i was off three days this week so that is not a lot of hours they have cut down hours a lot and these 5 to 10s are only 5 hours and then I have one 7 hour shift so I'm not really happy about that so I'm I'm just I'm trying not to overthink but you guys ordering for my shop really helps and you guys watching my video helps out a lot so I'm also trying to put out my applications out there I listen to this guy when it comes to the stimulus updates he said the stimulus has been passed and I've I think I posted that on my other Instagram, my main Instagram, and I'm just so happy that we can all get this little help and hopefully we can do something with it, either add it more to savings, add it more to debt or your sinking funds. That's amazing that we can have this money and you have, if you have kids, it's an extra $1,400 as well. And I think if you had unemployment last year that was less than 20, no, less than $10,000 and you claim your taxes that you paid money towards that i think the irs will refund you or either you have to send an amendment so just keep an eye on that if you either your husband or you were unemployed and then you got unemployment money from the government and it was less than ten thousand dollars you shouldn't have to pay for taxes on those and that was us to my husband my husband got unemployment last year and I file our taxes with his unemployment money so we should be able to get a little bit of refund from that I think or if we have to send an amendment they're still not sure but I'm hoping this passes through by next week I just got another order guys it's from Paulina I talked to her a lot on Instagram and she's been waiting for my May release before she actually sorry she's been waiting on my May release before she orders but she said she might have to do it in two sets just because she didn't want to overwhelm me but she's so sweet she ordered from my shop and she's been a continuous supporter ever since the other shop so i'm so so grateful that i have people like you guys and i'm gonna work on your order with so much love so much appreciation for you spending your money on my shop i know you guys have earned and worked for those every single penny that you worked for i have polina's order i have kayla's order I have Marissa's order and I forgot who the other one is hold on and I have Janine's order so I'm gonna work on those and I worked on a couple of orders yesterday like I said and I already sent that off so thank you guys so so much like I've never had this many orders in a while so I'm so so excited and I'm just so grateful that you guys are loving my stuff I hope you guys like them if ever you have a problem with your order please let me know please message me if usually people are saying like usually in december the tracking was taking so long i usually try to resend another order if it takes too long if something's missing i resend it mia woke up earlier than expected she shouldn't be up for another hour and a half but she is up i'm gonna see if she goes back to sleep but i did her numbers and this is a little bit spoiler of the video i don't know when i will have this video up but we're down to the seventeen thousand guys we're at the seventeen thousand. And 
before the student loans. If I'm not totally betting on it, if my student loans does get forgiven, we're at 10,000. And my February numbers was 20,325 compared to that 17,000 since we paid off our minimums of the month and we made an extra payment where we paid off my ring. We're down to 17,000. That's amazing. I'm so excited. I think we're going to hit our goal this year. If I get a better job, I think we're definitely going to hit our goal. And then we can start saving up for a down payment for a house. And we're also wanting to get a new car because my husband's car is a 2009 car. And it's honestly like getting there, like getting really bad. Like I know you guys know what I'm talking about. Like it's a 10, 10 year old, more than a 10 year old car. And we've been doing maintenance on it and it's just not doing well so we're just wanting to be prepared but it's ob obviously not our goal right now this is and it's it's going down guys oh my gosh let's get this baby she's not going back to sleep You're so pretty. You you were making lots of noises. Who were you talking to, huh? Who were you talking to, my pretty? You talking? Oh, so cute. So, so cute. Oh my gosh. Good morning. Tell everyone good morning. Oh. This is like um six. No, no, no. Nine to twelve months, I think. This onesie or six to nine, something like that but it barely fits her. Where are you going? Are you talking to me? I like mom, I've been calling you. I've been calling you. Why didn't you come earlier? I was waiting to see if you were gonna go back to bed. Oh, it's not time for you to eat. We're gonna hang out. We're gonna hang out, Mia. Yes. Mm -hmm. Huh? See, you're yawning. You're yawning, baby. I was watching you. You're like all over the place. Hmm. You're gonna have to be back in the crib because you're just crawling everywhere. And I'm just scared for you. <laughs> I was supposed to take a shower. <laughs> you're so cute. I'll take a shower later. That smells worth it. Worth everything. Alright, you want Betsy? And this is Betsy, my, my husband's very first gift to me when we weren't even dating. It's like Valentine's. You like Betsy? Hi! It's Betsy, Mama. It's Betsy. That was your Mama's Valentine's gift from Dad. morning guys it is I forgot what oh it's the night action I'm playing on my planner and not my budget planner but just my regular life planner and just seeing what is gonna come up and like stuff that has gone like I like to put notes like Mia's first grocery trip was the one you guys saw we went to Kroger and she did really well so we're so happy that she can sit up on her own now and we can take her anywhere basically because she's so curious that she doesn't even she doesn't even have time to like throw a fit or anything and I know that's gonna change eventually but right now it's so fun to take her out so we took her out to three places I think I showed you guys it was like last Sunday it's Tuesday now but we went to Home Depot we went to Kroger and we also went to Carter's so those three places have been successful and I'm so happy but like I said I I marked that on my planner and just life events like that I put down 
Hey baby! So she woke up earlier than expected and I was gonna take a shower and I really need to take a shower because mommy works today but I have a snack for her and I'll have her show playing while I take a shower and I can see her through the mirror so what we're gonna do today just so I can take a shower I know some of you guys can relate and she can she looks at herself <laughs> but that's what we're doing today so I can take a shower she's so cute I know she'll behave success guys I was able to do it took a shower like me <laughs> Alright guys, so I finished and I have two orders here and then one more order here and then another one here. So I'm pretty much done. I just gotta package whatever's left and package everything together with their shipping labels and I should be done with the orders. But I finished running these through the laminator again and corner punching them as you guys saw. And another good thing is my husband's wedding ring is has arrived. I buy these they're not really cheap but they are under a hundred dollars wedding ring and the first one that i bought him won't fit but i couldn't return it because it was already engraved so this one i didn't engrave it and i sized up a bit because he has stubby fingers so i hope this one fits because i really want him to have a wedding ring and he said he really likes the quality of the ring that i got him he just needs it to be bigger so we were saying oh maybe we should buy you like kind of expensive ring but he said no he's pretty happy actually he's more than happy with the ring that i gave him and if you guys want if you're interested let me know so i can link it in the description because it's a really good shop honestly they have different colors and it's like it has a good weight to it it's just i don't know the size of his finger and we wanted to go to a place to kind of size his finger but we just didn't have the time so i just kind of winged it and just kind of increase the size and if if it doesn't work out i know i could return it because we didn't engrave it this time so i hope it works and i'll show you guys later if it fits or not but it's like one o'clock almost two so my baby's gonna leave soon because i have to go to work today because i was supposed to be off today but i switched shifts with someone yesterday i was off yesterday instead of today so that's just how we're rolling and I just need to package these orders so I can actually have time to play with my husband when he gets home and we can eat together. Hi friends! I just got home from work and we're still on this vlog because as I was editing it, I'm still at 20 minutes and I like to make it a little bit longer than 20 minutes because I know you guys love longer vlogs. But today is March 14th if I haven't said anything but Today is Sunday and I just got off of work, so I'm gonna work on your guys' orders. I had six this morning and I had six yesterday and I had a couple more come in today, so I'm really, really grateful for everyone who's been ordering from my shop and I'm trying to pump them out as much as I can. I do take a slight break in between and play with my baby and spend time with my husband a little bit. What are you doing? What are you doing? 
because I was trying to get my controller and not interrupt you because I was trying to be sneaky, but it made me laugh. But I was following you. Was... Oh, well, leave that in because that's funny. I will. Don't worry, but... She's not going to leave it. I will. I will, but... I look haggard and I'm tired, but I am doing these orders. And I'm also making some trackers because a lot of you guys seem to like this and have my coffee over there. And I have some orders ready to ship tonight. And my husband said the latest he can go to the post office is, I think, 9 o'clock, he said. 9 o'clock. Having fun with these orders. But yesterday, we went to a mall somewhere over like 30 minutes away. And we went with our friends and with Mia. So we had a really good time. And I wasn't able to bring the camera. I thought I did. I even replaced the battery in a fresh... Um, a fresh memory card so I can film but I for I left my camera here so kind of like defeated the purpose of everything that I did but we went out and we bought a couple of things I think for me I bought some underwear which I really needed and then we were there to buy an outfit for my husband but we couldn't find one for him I think we're gonna try to look again maybe the next couple of days oh and we also went to go out and eat with Mia it was like a whole six hours of her not going to bed so she did really well and i was surprised but she was she was completely out in the car seat when we were driving home but it was so much fun i wish i was able to vlog but like i said i left my camera but i have we took a lot of pictures and it was a perfect day it was saturday i'm never off on a saturday so i'm so so glad i was able to spend that family time with mia and some friends time too Depends on where the wind is blowing too. Where the wind blows. She has no idea. <laughs> she got one Did it get one in her mouth? Yeah. Tastes terrible, doesn't it? It's all going that way. Good morning guys today is march 15th and i know this vlog is like a couple of days mashed in together but that's okay that's just how this week has been but as i was saying yesterday that i was so excited about the orders that i got right etsy decided to suspend my account because they couldn't identify my account with the id that i gave them which was my green card and my actual you know georgia id my state id and they said they couldn't identify it so they suspended my etsy account which is frustrating and i could just go back to the, my other etsy account that is good i guess but that one has a different name and i really like this name so i'm just gonna make my whole website and i'm not gonna let etsy take any of the money that you guys are giving me because they are taking a portion which is 20 percent and i also have to divide money up for my own taxes so it's like 40 percent just on just on getting you know getting taken so i had to talk to my sister but i finished laminating the trackers and hole punching them and everything so that's done but i don't even know what i was saying but basically i have to transfer to shopify because etsy suspended my store which is annoying they're not gonna fix it anymore so i'm just gonna do the shopify the same the same shop handles so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna do this for a week and i'm actually gonna give myself like five days off of like shop stuff because i'm gonna also try to enjoy my anniversary week because that is my this is my anniversary week another day another vlog i know i don't even tell me about how this vlog sucks already but i've just been so busy and like i said my shop got suspended so i'm trying to get my shopify up by the end of the week so that's going to be happening and i've also haven't told you guys but i've been working on getting another job and i did 
I'm technically part-time but we're working full-time hours right now so next week I'll be working five days I'll be working with my husband which is the job that I already had before so I know what to expect there's not gonna be a lot of stress when it comes to you know driving to and from to and from work because we're gonna be on the same shift we're finally gonna have a routine for our baby and it's not gonna be like fluctuating and I won't miss her crawling because I missed her crawling because I was at work at one point which I know happens but I'm just so glad I just got out of our orientation and I didn't want to like confirm it confirm it until you know I got in there because I already got hired there before but I couldn't get through the orientation because there was a problem on my background check because my my names weren't matching because if you guys didn't know in the Philippines we use our mother's last name and that's why my social security has my mother's last name but my ID doesn't because I realized we don't need our mother's last name in here so it's just different names and I think that's why my background didn't go through last time but now it did and I got my orientation I got my days which is next week I'll be working five days and I'm still working at CVS for a day which is Sunday morning just to kind of help her out until she can find someone or until like I burn out out of everything that I'm trying to do but I told her I'll be still working there Sundays so I can have at least Saturday off to work on my shop and work on my videos so that's why my videos has been so bad and my vlogs has been so bad like I've had it edited but I just can't seem to you know compile my vlogs together right now just because I'm all over the place and my anniversary is coming up and I had this like they called me Friday and now it's March 17th so I have my orientation today and then I start next week so it just kind of happened really fast and like I said I didn't want to mention anything because I didn't want to jinx it so now that I have a full-time not full-time I have a part-time job with my husband so I'm so so happy and it's also a pay increase it's a two dollar pay increase per hour and for right now we're working 40 hours every week for the next couple of weeks and then my what was promised to me was I think 20 hours so it's gonna work out I'm so happy and this is just a little bit better than what we have and we can have more money to pay debt with we also got our stimulus so I'm gonna have to budget that and what goes to debt what goes to savings what goes to my sinking funds what goes to me my husband and my baby because we are taking a portion of it as our own just to kind of have spending money just to kind of spoil ourselves because we've been like at this debt so much I think and also trying to save I'm also gonna do some printing and cutting of my April and my May stuff just because it seems like you guys really like my April too like a lot of you guys were ordering April stuff so I'm gonna be doing that and also budgeting also here are my dresses I've been really wanting to show you guys my dresses on but unfortunately I just don't have the time to put it on and show you guys I think I already said that but I'm just gonna show you guys really quick so this one is like contender number one it doesn't look much on the hanger but this one is my friend actually let me borrow this because I just wanted a black dress honestly just this is perfect and she also let me borrow this one which is I think a little bit more classy like I said it doesn't look that much on camera but on the back it looks nice it still has her tag but she let me borrow that too and then this one is the one I bought from TJ Maxx I mean um Ross so this one is my favorite but just not the color like I said it's too close to my color if it was black that would be perfect and then this one is the other one a little bit more like grown but those are my four options that I've been wanting to bring with me and just to kind of feel I really want to get a coat as well I might just go to a thrift shop to go find a coat because it will be a little bit chilly I think that's it because I have shoes I think for these but it's okay so these are my four outfits that I'm gonna choose from I'm gonna end the vlog because I'm exhausted I haven't had enough sleep lately just because I'm a bit stressing and I've you guys know I'm always stressed and my shop being suspended gave me a lot of stress and telling my boss that I can no longer work there full-time stressed me out as well because you know adulting stuff stresses me out all the fun things thank you guys so so much for watching this vlog I know it's been random I know it's been just like all over the place but I know you guys like watching this because it kind of gives you an idea of who I am behind my budgeting and just being who I am as a mom so I really really appreciate you guys 
being here and also I appreciate your time. Please subscribe down below if you're new and give this video a thumbs up.